Hello, my name is Alec Bridges, and I will be performing the excerpt from the Sarah Loves Her Juicy Fruit monologue from Greek 2. Fine. I was 15, um, but I could pass for 18 because I was big for my age. <clears throat> I'd go to bars, see live music. Um, well, an obscure band came to town. There were, there were only like seven of us in the audience, and they played one song in particular that transported me. It was called Sarah Loves Her Juicy Fruit. That night, I went out and I partied with the band. And I felt like I belonged for the first time. Of course, um, the next day, they couldn't stay. They had to go to the next town. So I'm walking home. As I'm walking down the street, a man in a red car pulls up to me. <laughs> he, he pulls his car up to me, rolls down his window, and he had the nice face. He said something to me. I'll, I'll, never, I'll never forget it. He said, he said, wow, today is going to be a good day. Well, he didn't take me back to town. He took me to a remote part of the woods where he beat me within an inch of my life gave me a shovel, forced me to dig my own grave, and told me that he was going to be burying me alive within the next few minutes. Now, I remember thinking to myself, I should be feeling really bad about this man. But he was magnetic. I loved him. Uh, he, was, he was smart. He was commanding. He was um, amazing in all ways. Except one minor flaw. Wasn't very good at tying knots. So, I loosened the rope from around my wrists, wrapped my hands around his neck, overpowering him with my sides, and I drained his life with my hands. And then I remember thinking to myself, Oh, this is my destiny. Sarah loves her juicy fruit, and Aaron loves to 